Hi, this is Neil from Pro Tools PC, and today I'm just going to give you a tutorial on authorizing, downloading, and installing the new gen audio AB Assist free plugin that we posted about on our website. I've seen some people on forums and on the web in general having a little bit of trouble authorizing, activating, and installing the plugin, and a couple of people saying that it didn't work in Pro Tools 10, which I've found it does, and so here's a quick guide to getting you up and running. I'll start with Pro Tools 10 and the authorization and activation process actually activates across both of them. So once you've done it in one version, it will work in the other. So I'll do it in Pro Tools 10 because that's the one I've seen people having trouble with. And hopefully everything will go smoothly for you. So let's go. Okay, to start with, go to your email order confirmation. So you have some links here. You can scroll down there is a box here for Avid Download Link, but it doesn't do anything. The important thing here is your code that you received. It says redeem this code at avid.com. So if you click on that link, it will take you to avid.com where you can fill in your details and log into your account. If you don't have an account, you can create one here but I have one, so I'm going to sign in. And then you need to go to Avid Software Activation and Download. So click on that. And here is where you enter your code. So what I'll do is go back to my account, select that code, copy that, and paste that code in here. And then I want to activate the product. Then you're taken to the My Products page, and this is the product now in my Avid account. And you can show details, and there you go. That's the download link for the software for Windows, and that's the software for Mac. So I'm going to download the software for Windows onto my desktop, and I'll let that download. Okay, it's finished downloading. We've got the AB Assist Setup Wizard. So click Next. I accept. Read the terms and conditions if you want to. Click Next. Choose the plugin formats that you want to install. So AAX plugin, that's the Windows 32 bit AAX plugin. And AAX plugin 64 bit, that's the Windows 64 bit plugin. So the 32-bit plugin is for Pro Tools 10, and the 64-bit plugin is for Pro Tools 11 and 12. So click Next. This is the path it will install to. You don't need to change that. And it's just a confirmation of where it's going to install the plugins. And as you can see here, this is my 32-bit path, x86. So the 32-bit plugin is going in the 32-bit plugins folder. 64-bit plugin is going into the 64-bit plugins folder. Click install, and we're finished. You can select to view the manual and finish. So the manual opens here. There's the send manual, which is part of the plugin, and the assist manual, which is here. So we can minimize that to start with, close that down, and we can go to Pro Tools. Okay, so first we're gonna try it with Pro Tools 10. So I'll launch Pro Tools 10. Okay, so we're gonna create a blank session. Let's see, new gen audio. So we've got assist and the send. So assist, you can insert on the master fader. To activate, please click below to register to get your personal license by email. So if this is the first time you've run it, you can click this Get Free License. If you already have a license, click the button below to activate the plugin. So we click Get Free License. And we will register for a new account. Choose a password.
Thank you for registering for a new gen account. Before you can access your My Account, we need to check your email address is correct. So we've sent you an email link with a confirmation to your email address. So go to your email. And here's my email. Thank you for registering. Activate my account page. Please choose a password for your account and log in. Now fill in some details. Please select your operating system, Windows PC. And here we go. So these are demos that you've taken to to start with. If we go to My Downloads, there is nothing there. My licenses. And it says you own AB Assist 1. But there is no license code. So let's go back to Pro Tools. And it says use license. Which method would you like to use? I'm connected to the internet. So I'm going to choose online. Enter your license code. So I need to go back and find my license code, my licenses, and there are no license codes present. So resend license information if you're having trouble receiving emails from us. We have sent all the licensing information linked to emails can take up to 30 minutes. There's another email for my licensing information. And this time, I have a licensing code. So I'll select that code, go back to Pro Tools, and enter my code. Apply license. Yes. Licensing completed. You successfully licensed this product. Continue. And the plugin's active. So there we go. That's the installation on Pro Tools 10 on Windows 10. Let's go and see if I need to relicense it for Pro Tools 12 or if it's going to just work from. 10's licensing. So I can save that project and launch Pro Tools 12. Okay, I'm going to open the project I created, new gen. And here we go, it's already licensed. So that's how to install and activate the free new gen audio av assist plugin if you have any questions or comments by all means leave them in the comments box uh, or on the uh, discuss discussion page on the website i uh, hope you found that useful and see you again soon thanks for watching